The Voskhod Russian, the Sunrise, was a spacecraft built by the Soviet Union's space program for human spaceflight as part of the Voskhod program. It was a development of and a follow-on to the Vostok spacecraft. Voskhod 1 was used for a three-man flight whereas Voskhod 2 had a crew of two. They consisted of a spherical descent module diameter 2.3 meters, which housed the cosmonauts, and instruments, and a conical equipment module mass 2.27 tons, 2.25 meters long, 2.43 meters wide, which contained propellant and the engine system. Voskhod was superseded by the Soyuz spacecraft in 1967. Topic. Design. The Voskhod spacecraft was, essentially, a Vostok spacecraft that had a backup solid fuel retro rocket added to the top of the descent module. The ejection seat was removed for more space and two or three crew couches were added to the interior at a 90 degree angle to that of the Vostok crew position. There was no provision for crew escape in the event of a launch or landing emergency. Lack of space meant that the three crew members of Voskhod 1 did not wear space suits. Both crew members wore spacesuits on the Voskhod 2 mission, as it involved an EVA and used an inflatable airlock. This allowed cosmonaut Alexei Leonov to exit and re-enter the craft. It was needed because the vehicle's electrical and environmental systems were air-cooled, and complete capsule depressurization would lead to overheating. The airlock weighed 250 kg, was 700 mm in diameter, 770 mm high when collapsed for launch. When extended in orbit, it was 2.5 meters long, had an internal diameter of 1.0 meters and an external diameter of 1.2 meters. The second crew member wore a spacesuit as a precaution against accidental descent module depressurization. The airlock was jettisoned after use. The lack of ejection seats meant that the Voskhod crew would return to Earth inside their spacecraft unlike the Vostok cosmonauts who ejected and parachuted down separately. Because of this, a new landing system was developed, which added a small solid fuel rocket to the parachute lines. It fired as the descent module neared touchdown, providing a softer landing. A backup solid-fueled retrorocket was added to the top of the descent module in the event that the main retrorocket failed. This had not been necessary on Vostok as the orbit was low enough that the spacecraft would decay in 10 days if the retrorocket failed, there being enough onboard consumables to sustain the cosmonaut that long. In any case, the Block E-equipped R-7 booster lacked sufficient lift capacity for a backup retrorocket. Since Voskhod was well below the maximum lift capacity of the larger Block I-equipped R-7, it would be put into a quite high orbit and not decay in 10 days. Voskhod utilized the 11A57 booster, essentially the Molnia 8K78L with the Block L stage removed to create a medium-lift LEO launcher, and later the launch vehicle for the Soyuz program. The spacecraft notably lacked any launch escape system, meaning that the crew would not survive a booster failure that occurred in the first two to half a minute of launch after payload shroud jettison, the descent module could simply be detached. Although work had begun on a less in 1962, it was not ready yet and so the engineers and cosmonauts simply had to gamble that the booster functioned properly during ascent, as by 1964, the R-7's success rate was improving but still not perfect. Topic. Vostok 3 kV 1964. Also known as Voskhod. Adaptation of the Vostok spacecraft for three cosmonauts. This version flew twice, on 6 October 1964 unmanned as Cosmos 47 and on 12 October 1964 manned as Voskhod 1. Topic. Basic data Crew size, 3 without spacesuits Endurance, 14.0 days Overall length, 5.0 meters Maximum diameter, 2.4 meters Total mass, 5,682 kilograms Propellant mass, 362 kilograms RCS total impulse, not available Primary engine thrust, 15.83 kN Main engine propellants, nitrous oxide, amine Total spacecraft delta V, 215 m per second 
Power, batteries, 24. 0 kW total. Re-entry module Crew size, 3 Diameter, 2.3 m sphere. Total mass, 2,900 kg Attitude control, none Environment, oxygen plus nitrogen at 1 atmosphere Controls, as Vostok 3 kA Navigation indicator, Globus Imp Navigation Instrument version 3 Landing system, sphere made ballistic re-entry, with shield side seeking correct orientation by virtue of the center of gravity being aft of the center of the sphere. Parachutes, single with suspended retrorocket package for soft landing. Crew stayed within the capsule. <laughs> Equipment module Length, 2.3 meters Maximum diameter, 2.4 meters. Total mass, 2,300 kilograms. Propellant mass, 275 kilograms. Reaction control system. Thrusters, not available. Thrusters pressure, 59 psi, 4 bars. Propellant media, cold gas, nitrogen at 2,200 psi, 150 bars. Propellant storage, 20 kg stored in 12 pressure bottles, 5 plus 5 plus 2 for first, second and reserve. Specific impulse, not available. Total impulse, not available. Retro rockets. Thrust, 15.83 kN. Propellant, nitrous oxide, amine. Specific impulse, 266 s. Delta V, 155 m per second. Power, batteries, 24.0 kW total, 0. 20 kW average. Topic. Auxiliary retrorocket module Length, 0 0.6 m Maximum diameter, 0 0.3 m Total mass, 143 kg Propellant mass, 87 kg Thrust, 117.7 kN Propellant, solid Specific impulse, 224 s Delta V, 60 m per second Voskhod 3 KD This version flew twice, on the 22nd of February 1965 unmanned as Cosmos 57 and on 18 March 1965 manned as the Voskhod 2 spacecraft. Re-entry module Re-entry module, Voskhod SA. Also known as, Spuskami Operat, Sherik, Sphere. Crew size, 2 Length, 2.3 meters. Diameter, 2.3 meters. Mass, 2,900 kilograms. Heat shield mass, 837 kilograms. Recovery equipment, 151 kilograms. Parachute deploys at 2.5 kilometers altitude. Crew lands in spacecraft. Touchdown rocket softens landing. Ballistic reentry acceleration, 8 grams, 78 meters per square second. Topic: <inaudible> Equipment module. Equipment module, Voskhod PA, also known as Priburni Otsik. Length: 2.25 meters. Diameter: 2.43 meters. Mass: 2,300 kilograms. Equipment in pressurized compartment RCS propellants, cold gas nitrogen. RCS propellants, 20 kg Main engine, TDU, 397 kg Main engine thrust, 15.83 kN Main engine propellants, nitrous oxide, amine Main engine propellant mass, 275 kg Main engine ISP, 266 S, 2.61 kN S per kilogram. 
Main engine burn time, 1 minute typical retro burn equals 42 seconds Spacecraft delta V, 155 meters per second Electrical system, batteries Electric system, 0 0.20 average kW Electric system, 24. 0 kilowatts h Topic. Auxiliary retrorocket module Auxiliary retrorocket module, Voskhod KDU. Also known as, engine unit Length, 0 0.60 m Diameter, 0 0.25 m Mass, 143 kg Engine thrust, 118 kN Engine propellants, solid Propellant mass, 87 kg Engine ISP, 224 s 20 kN s per kilogram Spacecraft delta V, 60 m per second <laughs> General data Total mass, 5,682 kg Total length, 5.0 m Endurance, supplies for 14 days in orbit Launch vehicle, Voskhod 11A57 Typical orbit, 163 km by 591 km, 64. 8 inclination See also Voskhod 2 Voskhod rocket Voskhod program Spacecraft Voskhod spacecraft Globus Imp navigation instrument